Stephen Wayne, 2022 with a defeat. What's your initial thoughts on that match tonight? Yeah, disappointed again um, with the way it played out at the end. I think I think our best moments in the game were early on. It was something we planned for. Um, with with good momentum, we get we get into good areas early in the, early in the match. We just didn't capitalise on them. And then again, kind of the half time team talk is consistent with what we've said a lot this season. Um, a lot of good things, but then we've conceded another another cheap couple of goals before, um, to lose our momentum in the game. Yeah, you mentioned that, especially sort of the first ten minutes. You know, I thought we really started the game well and, and tried to cause Rangers problems. And then obviously the quality that they do possess, they've they've obviously took the lead. Is obviously it's Rogers now. But is there any positives you you can take from this going into the next run of fixtures? Yeah, it was always going to be a difficult game. It was always we still came here with a positive mindset and tried to be as positive as we can. The last 15, 20 minutes of the game, you know, we're down to the absolute bare bones and the players are out on their feet and it's. Um, we're putting on uh, Lennon and Luca, 16 year olds who came on and done really well but you know you see on the flip of that what, what you're up against and what the kind of uh, impact their subs and the level of the, the subs and experience that they bring and, and you know so an occasion like this coming here today the plan was always to have a positive start and capitalise on that when we had that period we didn't we didn't we weren't clinical enough and again it's a lesson to look at what they've done and what they've done to create chances and then when they did get them they were clinical was something we can learn from. Yeah, absolutely. You did touch there on the two youngsters coming on. Obviously, a, a good experience for them at a, a venue like this. Do you think they'll have a big part to play in the second half of the season? Yeah, that's that's pretty much where we're at. I mean, even the players that were coming on, we didn't really have Kevin available for, to us from the start of the game, which was unfortunate again today. Um, a couple of players also coming out of their bed to, to play because we've got no other options. We, um, pretty much every every single player that we had at our disposal, you've seen today on the pitch. That's pretty much us as a whole. Um, so I think it's important that we get um, the players that aren't at 100% today back up to speed, the players that are ill, get them back in quickly and hopefully add, add one or two in the, in the window as quickly as possible. Yeah, and just finally moving on to Monday, another tricky test away at Livingston. How do you get the boys up for that one and another huge game? Yeah, it's, it becomes bigger and bigger. It's you know every game's massive just now. And the, the run we're on just now, um, it just makes it even more important. It's, I mean, the, the application and the effort for the players tonight wasn't in question at all. It's about how we now prepare and recover and get as many bodies as we can available uh, for for um, our biggest match of the season so far.